capital. Cody, since he's Otney, human, hey. Ooh, Latin. You saying Cody ain't human? Correct, he's an alien. But surely he can handle being a goose for two minutes. So relax, he'll be fine. <laughs> wow, overreact much? Hey, Lightning Jackson, new kid in class. I was wondering, what is going on? I don't feel so good. Of course you don't. Your head just fell off. Easy, guys. There's a very simple explanation for all of this. You see, a while back, Izzy built a rocket, went to space, landed on an alien planet inhabited entirely by other Cody's, then she came back. We don't talk about it much because there are so many other stories to tell. At least five seasons worth. <laughs> Cody phone. Whoa, whoa! You're trying to get a suit? Think, man, think! Call Planet Cody. Okay, that's better. What's the number, big guy? Stop! There's no reason to call Cody's home planet. We can just take him to a doctor's office. I'm not about to have an intergalactic incident pinned on me just because Cody can't handle his duck duck goose. No, 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 no. I am keeping a lid on this thing. Uh, Courtney, you can't just take an alien to a human doctor. Have some faith in modern medicine. We are taking Cody to a doctor, and that's that. Chef will drive us. Come on! Leaving us alone seems irresponsible. Who will watch us while you're gone? This picture I drew of myself is in charge till I get back. Can I go to the bathroom, Chef? I really need to go. <laughs> Chef, can I please? This place is like, what? Oh, yeah, it's all the weirds. Okay, Cody, say, ah. Uh, to human doctors? This is a minor setback. I know a place that specializes in exactly this kind of thing. Come on. Wait, what about her? Oh. She's a doctor. She can fix her own bones. We're here. Is this, is this Area 51? An intergalactic jail for bad aliens? Cody's not safe here. Uh, stop worrying. We will find an alien doctor, get alien medicine, and go back to school. But first, we need a distraction to get by the cards. How's it going, Chef? It took a lot of talcum powder to get into this outfit. Now, can you tell me why I'm dressed like this? Alien at the West Gate. Alien! <laughs> okay, the coast is clear. Let's head for the main building and find the medical bay. Oh, Planet Cody. Hey, if we just go to the roof, I could hack that giant satellite dish and contact Cody's home planet. Ugh, a long-distance space call during peak hours? For an extraterrestrial headache? No. We'll stick to my plan. Thank you. Courtney, I don't think the doctors here help aliens. Yeah, the doctors here are evil. Um, no. They took a Hippocratic oath, so I am sure... It sounds like it's coming from behind this door. No, Gilgatrix, no dessert till you finish your broccoli. I knew it! The hatred of broccoli is intergalactic. Let's just find the medical bay and fix Cody ourselves. There. Now, just relax, Cody, while I cure your weird alien disease. There must be some space surgery tools around here somewhere. Maybe we should 
just listen to Cody and call his home planet? You lost all credibility at Listen to Cody. This Cody never got a Bleasel Torpus 5.0 upgrade patch. We'll get you a new Cody. I'm outdated! Whee! Ah, I just love that new Cody smell. I smell like Cody! Wait, so we get a new Cody and that's it? I'm not in trouble? <laughs> You're not in trouble at all! was so worried about it. First, I got a human doctor pulverized, then froze a garden goo, then put my own teacher in extreme danger, and I even released alien prisoners from their cells. You released alien prisoners? Y yes Releasing alien prisoners is a class work nasal felony. You're under arrest. Bye -bye. Oh, crud. It'll take months to round up all those aliens. We'll just have to hope they don't cause any trouble. I don't need the bathroom anymore. Glad we convinced them that 
chef wasn't an alien criminal. And we got ourselves a brand new Cody. Everything worked out great. So, uh, what game you guys want to play next? Ooh, Doc, Doc, Goose! Yeah! <laughs>